All right, folks, uh, we're back with the GI Tanto, Tanto, whatever you want to call it. And um, I'm just doing some videos on this particular knife. Um, the reason being is, is that there is highly recommended across the, the Internet, the knife forums, and, and YouTube as being a great survival knife. $25 bug out knife, backup knife, and um, my perspective is I found that just to be a little bit hard to believe. Um, I bought the knife and I did a video showing uh, just some initial thoughts on that, and then uh, I did a video showing where I stripped it, and then I I did another video where I was doing, uh, attempting to do some rope cut tests. I don't think this is a bad knife, and I'm not making videos to hate on it or show that it's a bad knife, but uh, I just really wanted to find out for myself, and so I'm putting this through some paces uh, before I do take it on a, on a camping trip, and um, I'm just having some fun with it. So what I'm going to do today is a continuation of the test that I wanted to do on how well it retains its sharpness. So just to show everybody, the knife is sharp. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually carve points on these pine slats. They're just under a half inch thick and just under two inches wide. And what I want to do is, is I want to show that the knife cuts paper. Um, this knife might not be internet sharp or uh, knife form sharp, but what we're going to do is we're going to cut a point and then test the edge against paper one more time. And uh, we'll keep doing that, keep carving points until it stops cutting paper. We'll see how long it takes. I don't know what to expect, um, how long it might take or, or whatever. So yeah, that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Oh boy, this is, I can see this is going to be messy. I'm going to hit pause and I'm going to go get a chair so I'm carving down and not up.
All right, guys. We're going to call that a point. Let me get these gloves off, and uh, we'll go ahead and do a paper cut test. Uh, just some initial observations. That was a very difficult task. Um, this handle is not very comfortable. It feels good at first, but um, I would not call that a difficult or uh, strenuous task, but uh, my hand is killing me from uh, from holding this handle. The other one is, is that, you know, I get, I get that this wedge helps with penetration, but uh, when you're trying to do some finer carving and put, put your hand up on there, it actually became uh, quite uncomfortable. Well, I gotta tell you, um, it's cutting the paper pretty good, so I think it passed uh, round one, so if, uh, if I can handle it, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and try to do uh, a point or two on the other sides and see how that goes. Um, that's it, I'm gonna stop it for now.